This is your Preet again. Uh, welcome to our another video with newspaper blogging theme. So you can see I also use blog paper, uh, newspaper theme for my blogging, which is really good. And you can see uh, the performance. You will uh, see the mobile friendly theme and everything you will get in this theme. So now to the video, we will edit the page content means uh, we will edit the page or categories or post post blocks let me open any post here let me skip this so this is uh, our single post blog how to customize it so this is our single post in newspaper theme you can add a single post how your post will be look like to your customers right so uh, you can see here this is our single post you can scroll down you will see all the options here social media and uh, related articles so um, uh, people can comment here and uh, another post here so let me show you how to customize how to edit single post blog in newspaper team let me click on edit this green button so when you open uh, your website in another tab, uh, in same tab where you have hosting and the cPanel, you will see the green button to add it there. If you did not see that option, let me show you. Go to cloud templates, click on cloud templates. Once you click on cloud templates, you will see single post here. Uh, scroll down. This is a uh, single templates. So you will click here and add it, add it with TD Composer, okay. This will open same page if you did not see your uh, front page edit option, okay. Let me show you. This will open open the same, uh, same template, single post template as this is, right. Let me show you. So uh, we're in newspaper team, we can also customize the blog in sidebar as well. Uh, you can add the uh, um, AdSense ad in your single post and uh, uh, how you want to customize, you can uh, do it. Uh, you can um, uh, customize it very simple way. Okay. You don't need to have worry about it. So you can see uh, we have both same uh, template here. This is post. Let me show you in from the starting. So in the starting, we have a uh, category. This is the category, okay? Once you right click on, uh, show parent category first. Means um, the, this uh, blog post is belong to which category? Show parent category first. This will show that category, okay? In the starting point. If you don't want to show the category of this post, you can delete it from the delete button here, from the column, right? So next we have a title of the post. So title of the post default is H1 as default because this is a, a main title of your post. And uh, you can scroll down. You can uh, customize it. If you want to horizontal assign, let me click on. Uh, you can see it change the place. Okay. So you can um, even, uh, even customize its color. Let me select another color here red red color this is the title will be in red color so blue let me choose blue here so blue i think it look great blue so okay so once you have added everything let me show you another here title background you want to uh, change the background because we have background white background here in the title you can uh, change title as well title background as well let me choose like that you can choose the title uh, color of the title background right like this so now let me choose white color this will look great see this is this is very simple way you can add uh, add a single post template in newspaper so another option we have sem simple post to subtitle subtitle uh, if you want to give sub subtitle for your for your under your title, you can set your subtitle here. Otherwise, you can remove it. 
click on delete button delete that element right so now next we have uh, the date february 1 this is the date so uh, you want to uh, display in line means it will automatic adjust in the sidebar here click on this uh, display in line right so icon you can choose uh, color as well date color everything you can choose from here right after you add it make sure you save every single element because that's important maybe uh, you forget to save that but you when you refresh you will lose that uh, lost that uh, uh, change effects you will not see the effects right so in the sidebar let's go to the sidebar sidebar we have sidebar i have add the um, uh, the add adsense add so how we can uh, let me uh, let me first when uh, if you did not have this uh, sidebar add so i will show you let me delete it first let me see sidebar okay let me delete you will look like something this okay but now we want to show add in in the upper side so what we will do click on add we will search add add right and scroll down you will see add box we will drag it upper side here see we already drag it we will click right click here and we will choose add content add a uh, use add spot form i will choose sidebar this is a sidebar so how you will customize this how aut automatic ad will be shown let me show you this uh, once you click uh, once you go to the newspaper theme panel click on theme panel okay you will see add option so in add option sidebar we just add sidebar so in sidebar you make sure you add your adsense code here so once you select here sidebar it will automatic show this is like uh, you can choose as well custom ad number one custom ad number one we also have here right make sure you add your adsense code in every of single of these options so later on if you want to add it in in templates or, or element you can choose simply choose uh, use add spot form here okay according your needs as this is a sidebar so i choose sidebar i will click on save so this will be save later on so next option we have sidebar again most popular right click on it uh, you can uh, change give it name of uh, uh, you can add it the name like a trending today trending today so you will see the effects here it's already changed trending today click on save you can save every single element okay keep click on right click here and you also can choose which category post you want to show here like uh, some uh, someone open your um, download category and you can uh, you and you want to show uh, add uh, download category post as well here in the sidebar so what you will do you will go to filter category filter where you will choose that uh, that category here download i will uh, choose download so everyone visit here they will see that same category belong post here in the sidebar right so this is pretty simple make sure every time you add it uh, you add it any element save immediately right so let's click on the image okay so let me show you here feature image light box if i disable it let's see the changes okay so now hide when no feature image yes it will automatic hide if your post has no any picture it will auto hide and it will show only the uh, uh, only the post here right show content yes uh, caption position you want to show caption below image you can choose it from here over image you will see this caption of uh, image caption here in the upper side right let me choose with okay here so every time click on save now let's move on to 
uh, let's scroll down you can choose as well how many posts do you want to show in the sidebar you can choose it from here general scroll down limit post number six i want to show six image sometime the post is long post someone will scroll down and it, they will keep seeing your uh, sidebar post you can uh, you can display as many you want like this right so now we have in the downside we have the tags tags you use in your post those tags you will see it here okay tags source and via google and if you don't want these options or you don't want to show the tags you can hide it okay or you can delete this element right now we have down the share customer can share your post in any social media let me you can choose the shape of your buttons here let me show you you can see let's select round you can see it's around now you can choose any shape you want okay and click on save every time you uh, edit make sure you save so you will save your online time right so people can visit to the previous article yes i want to uh, i want to show they can visit last uh, previous article so simply they will click here now related articles you want to show related post you can choose this otherwise you can delete this article this blog element right simply you have to click delete element right now we have comment option for people upon the viewers can leave comment you can if you want to allow them to leave comment on your post on your blog you can keep it otherwise you can remove it Okay, so this is the uh, single post content. So let me show you. So other what other option you can add in your single category post. Okay, let me click on add. <coughs> in the single post, we will scroll down. We will look for single post short codes, short codes, right? So here, like I, I, I already explained you about the subtitle under the title you can pick it here and drag under the under the title so that's subtitle let me remove this okay this is how you can uh, you can drag uh, what option you want to uh, show on your single post you can just simply drag it on that place okay now we have single post date which we already have here Single post modified it, you can uh, display it. Single post author, you want to show the author, right? Who write this post? If you are a single author, you can leave it. You can skip it. Uh, single post feature image. So this is the feature image, right? It's already. If you use, if your template has not uh, uh, not showing any image or your post or your post image, you can just uh, simply drag this single post feature image downside anywhere uh, that will show your feature image automatically like that okay so you can delete it we already have this element okay now we will scroll down single post tag uh, same i show you the tags here these tags single post next and previous view this one in upper side no we don't have that option but we can make it enable here somewhere here single post uh, next and previous view so sorry this is here previous article same option right so single post comment if you uh, if your template has no comment option click single post comment from the side drag it here okay that's very simple you want to show single post review overview you can do as well uh, single post location display or reading progress bar reading progress bar uh, how many people watch your that post how many people react on your post that will show to other viewers right? so now let me scroll down 
uh, we have a category tag list other box and uh, some other exchange currency exchange or uh, Instagram list menu if you want to show the menu in the sidebar let me pick this and drag it in the sidebar down it will show menus like that we have to select the menu from here first select the menu header this will show the menus here in the sidebar okay so we will delete it let me show you other options here we have newspaper newspaper if you want to enable the newspaper people can sign up you can drag it uh, in the downside here in the end after the post okay you have to modify it you have to paste your uh, um, mailchamp or other uh, your marketing software that short code here okay let me delete it okay. next option let let's look at uh, other options we have here um inline text icon box you want to show any icon here you can do as well call on action you want to show call and action people can contact you you can do as well revolution slider if you want to enable slider you can do as well so these are uh these are very uh very simple way i can say anyone uh, beginner uh, if you just start blogging and you have a newspaper team you can add it to everything very simple way okay so now uh, in next video i will i will bring uh, the page uh, page template and i will uh, uh, customize um the landing page the footer the header how to uh, customize header footers everything so please stay in touch with me like share and subscribe my youtube channel i really appreciate it. okay so thank you so much for watching this video